Hi, welcome to the February Challenge Hand. It's Joan here. Matt Smith, a young Australian champion, gave me this hand. And it's a play hand. And it's rather important the way you think about which cards to play when. So let's look at the bidding first. West preempted with three hearts, showing less than an opening hand and probably seven hearts. Your partner North said double, that's for takeout. And now you, with 12 points, have to decide what to bid. You could bid clubs or diamonds, but that wouldn't really get us anywhere. The best bid with a hand like yours, when partner has shown an opening hand and a shortage in hearts, probably, is to try three no trumps. So, how to play this hand? The lead of the Queen of Hearts suggests that that's their long suit with Queen Jack. They've probably got the Queen Jack and the Ten and Seven Hearts. So we need to think that the Hearts will be Seven, Two, Two and probably Two in the East Hand. Where are we going to make Nine Tricks? We're going to have to, at some stage in this hand, take the Diamond Finesse. Well, the Diamond Suit might give us Five Tricks if the king is in the west hand or it'll give us four tricks if the king is in the east hand and the finesse fails. So let's say we've got four tricks in diamonds, we've got two in hearts, that's six, only one in clubs, seven, and we need to develop two tricks in spades by promotion. As Matt suggested, the difficulty on this hand is knowing whether to play diamonds or spades first. We need to promote the spades by forcing out the ace and we also need to take the diamond finesse by running the queen. So let's win the king of hearts here and think about it. If we were to cross back to the south hand, take the diamond finesse and it lost to east's king, east would return a heart and it would knock out our only other heart stopper so that when we then later lost to the spade ace and if west had the ace of spades they would then be able to take all their heart winners but if we lose to the ace of spades first and say west wins it and they return a heart and we win the ace then if we take the diamond finesse to east's king they won't have a heart to return to their partner so it makes sense that we should make the play in spades first. Yes, so West had the ace. They're returning a heart. We have to take the ace. Now we take the diamond finesse. And East won it. But East couldn't return a heart. That's because the hearts were seven, two, 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 and they haven't got any hearts left. So we made the right play. We win the Ace of Clubs, cross over to the Jack of Diamonds, take our winning Queen of Spades, and play the Diamonds. So that's given us seven tricks, eight tricks, and the Jack of Spades will be our ninth trick. So we made nine tricks. Had we taken the Diamond Finesse first, had it lost to the King, which it was, West would, East would have been able to return a heart, and even though we won the ace, then when we played the king of spades and lost to the ace, all of West's hearts would have been winners. So that would have been a disaster. But by forcing out the ace of spades first and later taking the diamond finesse, East had no hearts to return. Thanks for that hand, Matt. I think it was a really interesting play hand.